Hi, I'm Vinay, partner Fireside Ventures. So the number of times I've heard the word funding winter over the last couple of months, it's a fair portion of my word cloud. And I think uh, the, what we're seeing in terms of the tech meltdown in the US, recession in UK, what's happening in Europe, China, Southeast Asia, in terms of inflation and uh, the monetary flow, we're going to see some of that pain coming to India in the coming year. Uh, it's for now being shielded, but uh, at least the advice we're giving our startups is uh, to create a bulwark against this. Shore up their core business, focus on the core, focus on unit economics, core margin growth, and path to profitability. Maybe reduce the number of experiments that they're doing and really grow a profitable core business. On the budget, uh, well, uh, the way I look at it is one. Uh, Talent is always required to build large businesses and the ease of taxation law which we've been talking about for some time which penalizes employees from exercising their rights up front needs to be relooked at. There are a lot of playbooks from US, Israel etc. that one can look at on how we can improve taxation laws here to make it less onerous on employees exercising their rightful ease of. I think the other piece that uh, we've always uh, been looking at is uh, how do we get more domestic participation and domestic capital to flow into startups and maybe looking at some of the policies that enable large institutions like insurance funds, the EPFO, uh, bank treasuries to effectively participate in startups, looking also at the capital gain taxation laws which has a disparity between private and public markets and trying to create some kind of balance here could enable a lot more domestic flow into startups and therefore innovation. I think the third piece is I think a lot of work has happened on PLIs, manufacturing and ease of doing business and a lot of good work has happened there. But I think the startups are still looking for more and looking at how uh, they can get up and going and test out their business models faster and therefore single window clearances for various approvals across departments especially for asset heavy and manufacturing businesses to test out their business and when they are at scale they can always go back to the regular compliances but having a single window clearance upfront enables entrepreneurs to take greater risk and try out new business models.